Welcome to our video series, Feature Focus Spotlight by SonicWall. Today's topic, Sonic OS 711 Firmware Upgrade. In this video, we'll navigate through the features and benefits of SonicWall's Gen 7, and we'll also see a demonstration of the firmware upgrade process. If you are already familiar with the features of Sonic OS 711 and want to learn more about the firmware upgrade, you may jump ahead in the time bar below and click on the chapter labeled Operation of Firmware Upgrade to learn more about the upgrade or Firmware Upgrade Showcase Demo to see the upgrade process. Whether you're an end-user seeking enhanced security or a SonicWall partner eager to empower your clients, this video will explore how the new release can elevate your cybersecurity and make network management effortless. Before we dive into the features of Sonic OS 711, let's take a moment to preview the list of chapters in this video. We open with setting the stage, where we will explore the many features of the Gen 7 Firewall series, which is the foundation for our latest Sonic OS release. Next is exploring the 711 release, where we'll dive into the high-level features and benefits of Sonic OS. In the Spotlight on Firmware Upgrade chapter, you'll get a quick introduction to SonicWall's most advanced security operating system, Sonic OS 711, and the upgrade pathways we take to keep it that way. In the chapter End User Benefits, we will delve into why firmware upgrades matter for both end users and partners. The Operation of Firmware Upgrade chapter will explore some of the key points of how firmware upgrades work. Then, the Firmware Upgrade Showcase demo will guide you through a step-by-step -step demonstration of upgrading the firmware. The final chapter is our call to action for you to engage with SonicWall representatives, to ask questions, to explore additional features, and to begin a new experience in network security. Setting the Stage The Gen 7 Firewall series elevates SonicWall's cybersecurity strength by living up to our core mission, deliver unparalleled protection against evolving threats, setting a new standard in security excellence. Gen 7 firewalls form the cornerstone of a robust cybersecurity infrastructure that addresses today's challenges while anticipating tomorrow. Whether you're an IT pro or a newcomer, you will appreciate innovations that strengthen your network security and make it easier to manage. SonicWall goes beyond providing a product, we offer a solution and our commitment to your security. Exploring the SonicWall 7.1.1 release. Managing network security is complex, but SonicWall Gen 7 firewalls offer a straightforward solution that blocks advanced cyber attacks, while it evaluates and mitigates risks, and even simplifies how you manage your network. Gen 7 firewalls play a crucial role in safeguarding organizations against various threats, ensuring continuous protection from sophisticated attacks. Our commitment to staying ahead in cybersecurity is evident through our continuous hardware and software enhancements. Here's what's new in Sonic OS 7.1.1. Notable additions include advanced threat protection, a revamped content filter, enhanced DNS security, and seamless integration with Aruba ClearPass NAC. We've also significantly improved multi-cloud deployments based on feedback we received about previous performance and registration processes. Additional enhancements include NSV bootstrapping, token-based registration, and a new driver for NSV that increases overall performance. We also prioritized ease of use and operations by enhancing the app experience with a better user interface. Plus, we added support for Wi-Fi 6 access points. This comprehensive list of improvements reflects SonicWall's dedication to providing robust cybersecurity solutions and engineering user-friendly interfaces and processes. Spotlight on Firmware Upgrades Sonic OS 7 architecture is SonicWall's most advanced security operating system. It's the core of our current physical and virtual firewalls, including models from the TZ, NSV, and NSSP series. SonicWall will keep this architecture current and updated with five different classes of firmware updates. Each class has different features and purposes, so you can easily prioritize when to update. End user benefits. Upgrading your firewall firmware is essential to ensure your network's continued security and optimal performance. Firmware upgrades often include critical security patches, bug fixes, and vulnerability corrections that protect your firewall from emerging threats and potential exploits. By staying current with firmware updates, you not only enhance the device's resilience against security risks, 
but also benefit from improvements in performance, new features, and compatibility with evolving technologies. Regular upgrades align your firewall with industry standards and regulatory requirements, contributing to a more robust and compliant network infrastructure. Keeping your firewall firmware up to date is a proactive measure to safeguard your data, maintain a secure network environment, and leverage the latest advancements in firewall technology. Operation of a firmware upgrade. We can summarize the firmware upgrade process in four simple steps. First, we must download the file with our new firmware from the MySonicWall portal. Then, we must make a backup copy of our current firewall configuration. Next, we upload the firmware file to the firewall storage. And finally, we run the firmware upgrade. Looking deeper, the actual process of upgrading the firmware is also very simple. Step 1, run a backup of the firewall settings. There are several ways to accomplish this task. You may create a local backup, export your settings to a local device, and enable cloud backups or use FTP to transfer file settings to a server. Step 2, download the firmware version that corresponds to your firewall model from the MySonicWall web portal. You'll save the firmware file in an attached local device like a desktop or laptop computer. Step 3, upload the firmware from the local attached device to the firewall storage. Step 4, initiate the firmware upgrade. At this point, you may upgrade with current settings or factory default. Either way, this step will take about 8 minutes. Step 5, reboot the firewall. This task is done automatically by the firewall after the firmware upgrade is complete. Now it's time for the firmware upgrade showcase demo. Here, we'll demonstrate the simple processes involved with upgrading firmware for a Gen 7 TZ570 firewall. To begin, we'll log in into our account in the MySonicWall portal. Next, we'll go to the Download Center and search for the new firmware. In this case, we're looking for the associated 7.1.1 update for our TZ570. Click the Download icon to download the file. Select a local folder to save the file. Confirm that the file has been successfully downloaded into the folder. Log into the TZ570. Verify the current firmware version. The TZ570 is currently running Sonic OS 7.0.1. Before upgrading the firmware, perform a local backup, export settings, and enable cloud backup. Start by creating a local backup. Under the main menu bar, click Device, click Settings, click Firmware and Settings, then click Create Backup. Insert a comment, if needed, then click OK. On this screen, you can see that the local backup has been created. Continue by exporting the firewall settings to a local folder on your desktop or laptop computer by clicking Export Configuration. Click Export to continue. Select a local folder and click Save. As an option, you can enable Cloud Backup by clicking on the Cloud Backups tab, then toggle the Cloud Backup slider. Click Create Backup and select Cloud Backup. Enter a comment, if you want, then click OK. Then, verify the Cloud Backup has been created. Another way to save a configuration file is to use the FTP protocol and send the file to a server. We are now ready to upload the firmware file to the firewall. Click Upload Firmware. Click Browse to continue. Select the file we have previously downloaded from the MySonicWall portal and click Open. Click Upload. The upload may take a few seconds. You'll see the uploaded file, ready to use. Click the Action button. You'll see two options. Since you'll probably want to keep the same settings as before, click the option, Boot Uploaded Firmware with Current Configuration. If you want to restore default settings, select, Boot Uploaded Firmware with Factory Default Configuration. Click OK to continue. 
Most firmware upgrades take about 8 minutes to complete. The firewall will automatically reboot after the firmware upgrade process is complete. Enter the firewall management app after the reboot process completes. Use the main dashboard to check that the firewall has been successfully upgraded. And, now you're done. Conclusion and Call to Action Gen 7 and Sonic OS 711 mark a significant milestone in SonicWall's journey to excellence. So, there's more to learn. You can start by exploring your upgrade options. If you are a partner or current SonicWall product user, check the user portal at my SonicWall for the latest features and updates. If you are new to SonicWall, please reach out to your SonicWall representative or solution engineer today by scanning the QR code on the screen. Subscribe for future feature focus spotlight episodes for more insights on other developments and updates from SonicWall. Thanks for watching.